What's up YouTube? Coming back with another video. <clears throat> you know most men, most men out here in America, normally or usually, they sling their dicks for free. Most men out here fucking these females for free. And really ain't getting nothing out of it. Maybe a good argument. Maybe busting a good nut. That's about it. Like my uncle would tell me. Yeah, you don't sling this dick for free. Because most of these women out here don't sling that pussy for free. It's usually a fee. Or hidden fees. <laughs> Shit that's written in fine print that you can't see unless you're really paying attention. Men out here slinging dick for free, and normally becoming slaves to their dicks, busting nuts. In the wrong bitch. You ain't cost you your livelihood. Your most some of you cost your lives. But most of you men don't even learn from it. Keep busting nuts. Then you keep busting nuts in the same bitch. The same bitch that enslaves you in the first place. You keep running back, keep running back. Cut the pussy good to you. Putting more babies in her. And she collecting more and more of your income. Then you someone crying to someone else about your problems. And half and, and, and how half of your check is missing. But there's no fault but your own. I know you enjoy busting nuts. <laughs> Shit, who don't? I mean, I guess some people don't. Some people can't really. Some people can't have orgasms. Don't even know what it feels like to have an orgasm. But you're out here slinging your dick for free and you're being penalized for it. Being penalized for busting nuts. Especially if you're busting nuts in the wrong place. These broads ain't loyal. They're not loyal at all. And that's most of them. She got the right to kill your seed. <laughs> she got the right to kill your seed and make money off of your seed from you. She got the authority, that power to enslave you from your own seed that came out of your loins. The child didn't come from her, it comes from you, it comes from the man. That's your seed. She just carried the seed. But it's the world that we live in, it, it, it makes her the soul, the soul lone creator of that child, and she is not. And if she have soul, the way I look at it, if she got soul responsibility, or say so about that child because it's in her body, then she should be able to, to care for that child by herself. Without the man support, financial support. That child support shit is all a hustle, man. It's a scam. <laughs> you know, it's all a scam. They say it's for the kids and all this bullshit. 
a man misses payment or whatever the case is, then you suspend his license. Either you lock him up or or you suspend his license. Then the man loses his livelihood. And how the hell he gonna take care of his children? That don't even make sense. You become a slave to your dicks. You all here busting nuts and stupid broke bitches. <laughs> you know, I guess most of us men are guilty of that. We stick and stick our dicks and broke dumb bitches. <clears throat> That's what we do. If a bitch gotta go to the court and, and beg for uh, uh, assistance or gotta put you on a, a child support or some shit like that, the bitch broke. Ain't no boss bitch gonna go down there and take out no fucking child support. Ain't no real bitch. Excuse me. Ain't no real woman. No alpha female gonna go anywhere and take out nothing on nobody. Because she can handle her own fucking business. If you that bitch can take your sorry ass down to a, 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 a clinic... An abortion clinic and get rid of that child without that man's consent, then you should be able to uh, to provide for that child all on your own without the aid of his financial backing. Yeah, was he stupid for busting nuts in your stupid ass? Yeah, he was. <laughs> Got caught up in the lust. Got caught up in the moment. Temptation is great. Half you bitches walking naked. Half shit might as well say naked. Kempt in men all day long. All the trap. All the scam. The government give you, give you bitches these clothes. These, these revealing clothes. To tempt these men. Having babies by the pound. <laughs> Having babies by the pound and, and enslaving your own damn self. Stop trapping yourself, then crying, crying for freedom because you're not going to get it. Not as long as you're, you're up under this Caucasian rule, his kingdom. This is the way that he has it set up. I mean, you can go from woman and woman producing kids. Woman and woman and woman and woman and woman. You can't marry none of these bitches all at the same time. What is called polygamy, I think it is. That's the way it should be anyway. I mean, if you if you got five baby mamas and you paying five of these broads money for your child, God damn it, that's, you might as well call that shit polygamy. Just in separate houses, which is stupid. <laughs> all that shit's stupid. You got these athletes or celebrities that make all these millions Got big ass mansions, man. A uh, big ass house with numerous of, of rooms. 15, 14 um, um, rooms in one house. But you want to marry to one woman <laughs> when you got multiple baby mamas scattered abroad. And ain't none of them bitches in that mansion with you or your kids. And you got money going out outside of your household when them women and those kids should be in that mansion with you. As a big family, a united family in harmony and in love. What the fuck you got that big ass house for? Doesn't make any sense. Not to me anyway. But this is the system that we live under. So if you were smart, you 
will stop wasting your time with these broke ass bitches. That's looking to come up off of your hard labor and the job that you have. Becoming a slave, don't become a slave to your dick. You know, I oftentimes tell myself that. Don't don't be don't don't become a slave to your dick. Find your find yourself on child support. Missing your missing half your fucking check every week. <laughs> now you're struggling to pay your bills because half your check is missing. And most of the time them ungrateful bitches don't even appreciate that shit. Oh, it ain't enough. I need more than this. It's not enough. Bitch, ain't nobody tell you to have that child. Nor are you broke. And if, you, if, and if that nigga broke, then shit. What you expect? What you expect to happen? Your ass broke and he broke. And you should appreciate the little crumbs that you do get from this man. <laughs> <laughs> shit is crazy man you know having kids is supposed to be a blessing but this, once again this system turned um, the blessings of fatherhood into a curse now you got men out here killing women behind this this thing behind child support they're killing women and they're killing babies too because they don't want to be trapped trapped with that child support shit because it, it, it's penalties, repercussions, and consequences that be, that become behind that. That's behind, they come, behind, come with that package anyway. It wouldn't be as bad if you didn't lose your livelihood because you missed a payment. So men out there, stop becoming slaves to your dick. Shit, you better off <laughs> busting it up, nut in the tub. <laughs> you better off busting nuts in the tub while you're taking a shower or something. Instead of busting nuts in these broke, ungrateful, trifling, good for nothing ass bitches. Or you be like this guy. Give us free. <laughs> uh, like the old head used to tell me back in the day. Shit. You made your bed and then you lay in it. And while you laying in it, stop crying. Because it was your choice to fuck that broke bitch. It was your choice. To nut in that broke bitch. It was your choice. To go back and bust more nuts in this broke bitch. After she put you on child support with the first child. And you continue to go back. And bust nuts in that broke bitch. And nobody fought but your own. Them broke bitches love the way this system is set up right now because it benefits them. It's more beneficial to them. They have the power over your loins. I don't criticize no man that busts nuts in a broke bitch <laughs> in the heat of the moment. Rather, it is, is a, a one night stand or whatever the case is. He's busting that bitch and keep going. Fuck. No looking back. The fuck are you looking back for? It was a one night stand. You bust off. Keep it moving. Then if you look back trying to be this uh, good morale person, then you find yourself trapped. Keep it moving. Them bitches do it all the time. Take your seed and they kill your seed. You know nothing about it. 
I tell a motherfucker quick. She, she'll jump off, get the bitch a fake name, a throwaway number, whatever the case is. Bust your nut and move. Keep it moving. Or wear a condom. Sometimes the, con the, con the condom doesn't always work. That shit busts. And the bitch end up pregnant anyway. <laughs> you got a bob and weave out there. Bob and weave. God damn it. Bob and weave. Oh, you find yourself in chains. Being a slave to your dick.